The Lord of the Rings, The Return of the King is the third and final installment of the epic fantasy film trilogy directed by Peter Jackson, based on J.R.R. Tolkien's novel of the same name. Released in 2003, the film concludes the story that began in The Fellowship of the Ring and continued in The Two Towers. Here is a long explanation of the movie. The film picks up where the two towers left off, with Frodo Baggins, played by Elijah Wood, and his loyal companion Samwise Gamgee, Sean Astin, continuing their perilous journey to Mount Doom and Mordor, the only place where the One Ring can be destroyed and the Dark Lord Sauron defeated. Meanwhile, their friends from the Fellowship of the Ring are scattered across Middle-earth, each with their own part to play in the war against Sauron. As Frodo and Sam draw closer to Mount Doom, they encounter the treacherous Gollum, Andy Serkis, who was once the Ring's previous owner. Gollum becomes obsessed with reclaiming the Ring and attempts to manipulate Frodo into his own schemes. The Ring's corrupting influence weighs heavily on Frodo testing his resolve and the loyalty of Sam. In the kingdom of Gundor, Aragorn, Viggo Mortensen, embraces his destiny as the rightful heir to the throne. With the help of Gandalf the White, Ian McKellen, he rallies the people of Gundor and leads them in a final stand against Sauron's forces, which include the fearsome orcs and the terrifying Nazgul. Aragorn seeks to fulfill his role as the true king and bring hope to a world on the brink of darkness. Meanwhile, the elf Legolas, Orlando Bloom, the dwarf Gimli, John Rhys Davis, and the wizard Gandalf assemble an army of various races, including elves, men, and the tree-like Ents. Together, they prepare for the climactic Battle of Minas Tirith, where the fate of Middle-earth will be decided. The battle is a desperate struggle against overwhelming odds, with lives lost and sacrifices made. In another part of Middle-earth, Frodo and Sam finally reach the fiery Mount Doom. Gollum's true nature is revealed, leading to a dramatic confrontation among the three. Frodo, tempted by the ring's power, succumbs and claims it as his own. However, Gollum attacks Frodo, biting his finger off to regain possession of the ring. In the struggle, Gollum falls into the volcano's molten lava, taking the ring with him and ensuring its destruction. As the ring is destroyed, Sauron's power crumbles, and his armies are defeated. The remaining members of the Fellowship reunite, and Aragorn is crowned king of Gondor. The hobbits, including Frodo and Sam, return to their homeland, the Shire, but find it changed by the war. However, they manage to restore peace and rebuild their lives. The Return of the King is a grand conclusion to the trilogy, combining intense battles, emotional journeys, and themes of heroism, friendship, and sacrifice. The film won numerous awards, including 11 Academy Awards, including Best Picture and Best Director, making it one of the most critically acclaimed and successful films of all time. Like, share, subscribe.